It's been a crazy, crazy week. I've had so many messages from you guys saying, hey, Dane, I can't find your MetaTrader to DX trade copier, your MetaTrader to match trade copier, or your MetaTrader to trade locker copiers. Where are they? Last week, Friday, all of my copiers got removed and banned from the MetaTrader store. But don't worry because I've been busy, busy, busy this week building my own platform, which launches today. And in this video, I'm gonna be taking you through how you can get all of these copiers and we're coming back stronger than ever. So stay tuned. Before I share with you the details of the new platform and how you can get these copiers, let me just take your mind back to last week, Friday, when all of this happened. So at the time I was out, I was having lunch, I was having a great day. And then when I come back home, I check my messages from my community and a few people had messaged me saying, hey Dane, where's your copy? I can't find it, have you taken them down? So I was thinking, I ain't taking it down, what's going on? So I logged in to my account, noticed that the copiers weren't there and I was thinking, oh my gosh, what happened to the copiers? So I reached out to MetaTrader, sent them a message asking them, why did they take them down? And I didn't get any response for the first couple of days. So obviously this was really confusing for me and people were just messaging me over and over again. Where's your copy? I can't find it. Have you taken it down? What's going on? So I'm not gonna lie to you, it was a very stressful moment. So I sat down and I had a good think about how can I provide these copiers to all of you and be able to manage them in the way that I would want to. So after crying myself to sleep that night, on Saturday, it was time to get to work. So I put together a plan. I thought to myself, I'm going to obviously need a website. I'm gonna need a good backend to manage licenses, manage you know the security users, things like that. So me and my business partner, we just went full blast trying to put this together. And one week later, I'm now ready to launch. So I did actually end up hearing back from MetaTrader and you know they told me that essentially third party copiers to other trading platforms is not actually allowed on their marketplace. That obviously makes a lot of sense and it's something that I must have overlooked in the rules. However, before you can actually put a product onto the MQL market, the product needs to be reviewed and proved. So they obviously reviewed and approved it. I thought it was all good. And then about six weeks later, I just randomly see that it's all been taken down. They didn't give me any notice, no warning. And it also took them like four days to get back to me. But now we are here and we're definitely back stronger with way more options than we had when we was back on that platform. So. Now you're all wondering, so where can I go to pick up these copiers? These copiers will be available on my website and that is going to be danetrades.com. My website is live right now. So if you want to go there and check them out, then you can, okay? It is still going to be a EA that you install in your MetaTrader, okay? I haven't gone into a cloud copier or anything like that. The EAs will work in the exact same way that they have worked before, there's just one more stage that you've got to do to validate your license. But apart from that, the EAs are exactly the same. So the first question that I want to answer is how can I try a free trial of your EAs? Well, if you go to my website and you scroll down to the product section, you will see links for free trials on all of the copiers. So there's a copier for MetaTrader to DX Trade. There's a copier for MetaTrader to MatchTrader and there's a copier for MetaTrader to TradeLocker. The trials last for seven days, but there is a message that comes up every four hours that will make you restart the EA. It's just one of the limitations of a free trial, but you can just restart it and you can test it out for seven days. Now guys, I recommend that before you go ahead and buy it, make sure that you at least test the free trial and make sure that it runs on your broker because I know with certain prop firms, certain brokers may not allow it. So just make sure you test it first. If you do wanna go ahead and get yourself one of these copiers, then all you have to do is register on the site and then you'll be able to 
purchase one of these copiers. The reason why you have to register before you can get a license is because the license will be attached to your login. Now, once you have made the purchase, you will get a email confirmation. And in this email, you will have a download link to the EA. The way that the licensing works, I wanted to keep it as similar as possible to what I had on MetaTrader. So your license will be valid for up to 10 devices and you can have it on as many accounts or as many terminals as you want on those 10 devices. So that is what the license gets you. Once you have downloaded your EA, you're going to need to install it. So the first thing that you need to do is go into your terminal, go into tools, go into options, and you want to go into expert advisors and find the web request. Because in here, you're going to want to add this URL, https forward slash danetrades.com. The reason why you need to add this address is because when the EA first loads up, the first thing it's going to do is ask the platform, do you have a valid license? Now, once you've added this address, you're going to want to put the EA into the data folder for your terminal and you want to put it into the expert folder. Don't worry if you don't remember every single step. There are user guides on the website that explains all of this in detail. The next question that a lot of you want to know is what if you have purchased it from the MQL5 website and now you want to be migrated over into my new platform? Do you have to pay again? The answer is no, you do not have to pay again. If you are still using the EA from the MQL5, you should be able to use it fine but there will be no more new updates because obviously those products have been removed. So I cannot give you any new updates. So if you want to move into the new system and keep receiving updates, then you can send me a request to get migrated. Um, it's not gonna cost you anything, but I will need some things from you. So in order to make this request, you will need to send me an email with two screenshots. The first thing that you're going to need to do is log into your MQL5 profile and then you're going to want to go to your purchases section and send me a screenshot of this page and make sure that not only the licenses are showing for the EAs but also your username is showing. The second screenshot that you're going to want to take is if you go into your profile settings and then you go to the security tab, take a screenshot of the email address again along with your username and send that to me in an email. Sign up to my website with that same email address and then once I've approved your request, I will add you to the product that you have purchased. Then you can go ahead and download the EA from the download center under my account and make sure that you replace the one from MetaTrader. The next question that I'm going to answer is how would you update the EA? So this is something that I couldn't do in the MetaTrader because it was against their rules. But what I can do now is when your EA logs in, it can also send you a notification if there is a new update. So when you first log in, if there's a new update, you'll get a notification. And then if you want to update, if you go to my account, go to the download center and download the EA that you have and then just replace it with the one that is in your expert folder. The ones that are gonna be in the download center, they're always gonna be the most up-to-date versions. So if you're ever unsure, then feel free to download it there and then put it into your expert folder. There's only one additional stage that you have to do when you load the EA that you didn't have to do before to check the license. When you load the EA, go to the input tab and you will see two new inputs, one for your email, one for your password, here you're going to put the same login details that you made for danetrade.com. So put in your email and your password. And then when the EA loads up, it's gonna check your account and see if you've got a license. And if you have, the EA will load up. If at any point you have any troubles, then there is a user guide. They're all now available on the website and it's pretty easy to find. Just look for the tab that says user guides and then you can find them there. So when you're going through the EA for the first time, I highly recommend take a look at the user guide. It explains all of the features and what they do. 
The next thing that I want to talk about is FAQs. So I know many of you have questions. A lot of the questions are kind of the same. I'm seeing the same questions get repeated. So if you go to the FAQ section, I'm sure your questions will be answered. Obviously, if it's not in there, then feel free to send me a message at support at danetrades.com. But if you ask me a question that's in the FAQ, I'm just going to send you a link back to the FAQ. So make sure you check it out. It covers most of the common questions that you guys are going to have. And also, just as I've mentioned, if you do need any help or any support, there is now a new email address that you can email, and that is support at danetrades.com. So any issues that you need, send an email to that address and I will get back to you. Or you can still reach me in my Discord. Um, there's also a support channel for these copiers there. So if you have Discord, then reach out to me on Discord. And then the final thing, which I'm actually quite excited about because I've had many, many requests for this and I couldn't do it before MetaTrader because it just wasn't a feature. But now on my own platform, I am offering the opportunity for you to be an affiliate partner with me and these copiers. If you're someone who has their own community or you're a part of a community or you just really like the EA and you want to share it with others and get rewarded for it, then you can register for the affiliate partnership. So if you go to the website, scroll all the way down to the bottom, you will see a link for register to be an affiliate. So if you click on that, make sure you fill out all the details so that I can review it. If you don't fill out the details, then I won't be able to approve the request. But once you become an affiliate, you will get a discount code for 5% off any purchase if somebody uses your link and you will get back 10% of that sale as well, which is very, very nice. So yeah, if you want to be an affiliate, then you can also do that as well. So guys, I'm very excited about what's going to happen in the future. So now that I've managed to actually build this platform um, that is my own, you know, that opens up many, many options. It opens up many, many doors that weren't open before. So yeah. I'm very excited to share this with you guys. So make sure you head over there now. Make sure you share, like, comment on this video. I am thinking about doing a video on my thoughts on this situation with prop firms at the moment because it's all gone a little bit crazy and my opinion has changed on prop firms a lot. So if you want to see that type of video, then let me know in the comments below. But until the next time, guys, I will speak with you all soon.